Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Edmond Mendaros and for today's quick tutorial and I'm going to show you guys on how to resolve Microsoft error and read this another account from your organizations is already signed in on this device error in Windows computer and several factors can trigger this error include Cache credentials might linger in the system, confusing Windows into thinking an account is still active, multiple works accounts, misconfigured, issue AD settings, corrupted system files, and third party security software. And without further ado, and let's go ahead. So the first solutions we will do is to sign out of all Microsoft accounts. So all you have to do is to press the Windows key plus letter I on your keyboard to open Windows settings. And then once open up, at left side navigations pane, and then you need to select these accounts. And on right side, and then scroll down. And then under at account settings and select email in accounts and then click. And here at email in accounts and then under at accounts used by other applications. And then you can see here this email account on my system. And then we need to remove to fix the error. So select those email account and on right side and then click this arrow. And then you need to select this remove account and on right side and then click remove. And then there's notifications here. Are you sure you want to remove this account? And then click yes. All right. So once you're done here, and then we need to close this window settings. And other solutions that we're going to do is to remove cache credentials. So all you have to do is stop it up on a search menu. And then here at search for apps, and then you need to type control panel and then click open. And once you open up this control panel, and then we need to modify by clicking this view by, and then click this arrow, and select this category. And then next step, then you need to select user account. So here at user accounts, and then you need to select credential manager, and then click. So here at manage your credentials and then we have the option here. So we have web credentials and the other one is Windows credential. So all you have to do is to select Windows credentials and then click. And the next step, then we need to remove this Windows credentials email here and on right side and then click this arrow. And then you can see here this remove settings and then click. And are you sure you want to permanently delete this Windows credential and then click yes. Alright, so once you're done here at Credential Manager and then we need to close. And the other solutions that we're going to do is to run the SFC scan. So all you have to do is to open up on a search menu. And then here at search for apps and then you need to type a CMD. Or a, this is the command prompt and then you need to right click and select run as administrator. If you receive your account control and then click yes. And once you open up this administrator command prompt, and then we need to enter and type this command keyword as fc space slash scan now. So slash scan now that is one word and then press enter. And beginning system scan this process will take some time. Beginning verification space of system scan. So here we need to wait to complete the verifications into 100%. So this command keyword as FC scan now is a command used in Windows to run the system file checker as FC tool, which scans all protected system files on your computer and replaces any corrupted or incorrect versions with the correct Microsoft versions. Then we need to wait. To complete the verifications and a verification 100% complete and then a next step then we need to close this cmd and then here at the start menu and then we need to restart all right so that's it guys on how to fix another account from your organizations is already signed in on this device error in windows 
and please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more quality content. Thank you guys and see you in my next tutorial.